Y'all know the co-op took some hits. Joe, hungry man, good people, especially Joe. Their passing was for real cold-blooded. I know what you're thinking, so I'm gonna put it out there. I'm responsible. A week or so back, made a move on Omar with Joe's approval. Faggot ain't have hard enough to come at me, so he come at those close to me. Now, I'm doubling the bounty. Hundred large for a whiff of that dick suck. 250 for his head. What about to connect? I got that covered. And in light of that fact, I'm gonna take it upon myself to conduct this meet. Slim, I want you to take over Hungry Man's slice of the cake. Meaning no disrespect, but I ain't cut out to be no CEO. <laughs> Cheese, then. No problem, man. Got you covered. Mm -hmm. Milton came with 600. And Lil Glenn is in for three. I got five from me, and I got five from China Man to cover. We still short 900. I can go with that, no time. What? Motherfucker, where you get that kind of scratch? You don't think Cheese know this here, gang? We selling dope and coke in Baltimore, nigga. Any of y'all ain't got that kind of money need be ashamed. You're still putting up more than your share with this. The way I look at it, we all gonna be more than paid once we own the connect, so. Shit, nigga, we was good when your uncle had it. We had to go ahead and put up with Marlo. See that? See now? That's just the wrong way to look at it. Cause Joe had his time. And Omar put an end to that. Then Marlo had his time, short as it was. And the police put an end to that. And now, motherfucker, it's our time. Mine's and yours. But instead of just shutting up and kicking in, you gonna stand there crying that back in the day shit. Jeez. There ain't no back in the day, nigga. Ain't no nostalgia to this shit here. There's just the street and the game and what happened here today. You right. When it was my uncle, I was with my uncle. When it was Marlo, I was with him. But now, nigga. What the fuck you do that for? Now we short the nine. That was for Joe. We gonna bounce back on the motherfucker, no question. Bounce back on who? Marlo, boss. Oh, he gon' fall. Marlo, Marlo ain't got shit to do with it. Marlo come get string like that. String died because of some other shit. What? He died because of some other shit, nigga. I couldn't fix it. I tried. That nigga string was right about this shit, man. That nigga was right. Fuck Marlo. Fuck this fucking war. All this beef over a couple of fucking corners. Don't matter who did what to who at this point. Fact is, we went to war, and now there ain't no going back. I mean, shit, it's what war is, you know? Once you in it, you in it. Yo, how we not going through a few hot ones at the motherfuckers? One ass whooping and we back off like some bitches. And then we on this off-brand ass strip right here, ain't even enough trade for Putin and his crew. It's some bullshit, man. Hey, look, man, Stringer gonna fix it, man. You'll see. Which one of y'all is Slim Charles? And who asked? That be Cuddy. Your boy gave me a number, said to bring you up when I was ready to put in some work, but no answer. Took your time calling back, right? Numbers don't play out a few days, man. You change them up. Yeah, ain't you know nothing? Respect, dog. Respect. Man, y'all don't know who y'all talking to, man. You still ain't say your business, man. I'm trying to get put on. What you got in mind? Whatever you got that pays. Yo, poop. Come here, man. Man, look, man. Call Shamrock, man, and tell them soldier finally came into the camp. You a soldier, huh? Chill, Bodhi, man. Chill, man. You ain't got to worry about crossing no intersection. Come that way. You putting your driver in the line of fire, man. Think on it. He getting taken out. Car gonna crash. Now, where that put you at, Mr. Look, pick your targets, drop them, and move out quick. Who driving, man? I'm under the wheel. All right, you make sure you slow down at the end of the block and toss your weapons. And get rid of any shell casings that kick back in the car. Police can trace them shits. Toss the gloves, too, right? Nah, hold on to them. 
they gonna have that DNA shit all on him. On a Sunday morning, y'all try to hit a nigga when he taking his wrinkle ass grandmas to pray? And y'all don't hit the nigga neither? All y'all kill his grandma's crown? And by the time Sham say go, oh my damn near in the cab. Ain't enough y'all that violated this Sunday morning truce. No. I'm standing here holding a torn up church crown of a bona fide color lady. Do you know what a color lady is? Not your mom's for sure. Because if they was that, y'all would have known better than that bullshit. Can't go through the front on this boy. So I'm thinking we're going to have to creep around the back. Get the bond on it. Oh, I got this for that other problem. Huh? Who this? Remember Fat Face Rick, right? I'm going to them co-op meetings with String. That's his cousin Trina. Oh, you mean Trina with the big old ass? Yeah, you own it. That's her work number. You know what she working at nowadays? She over at the Department of Social Services. So you think Omar getting a check? Uh, nah, not now, but I mean, once upon a time before, uh, some fool gave little Omar a little uh, a shotgun. I mean, cocksucker was somebody's child, right? So I'm thinking somewhere down in them records is one or two names of Omar's people. You feel me? You sure you want us on Marlon or Omar both? I mean, Omar ain't come back on us since we got his bitch. So maybe... Look, I'm home, Charles. I'm home. What's up? Take care of Ben String? Me too, man. I need you to hit somebody. Who we hit? Clay Davis. The Clay Davis? Downtown Clay Davis? That's supposed to mean something to me, man. That nigga needs to be got. Shit, straight murder ain't no thing. But this here's some assassination nigga, I shit. Told you. I asked you once, where'd you? Skip past the talking. Do what you feel. Joe ain't had nothing to do with it. Slim, you gonna make me hurt you, yo. Ask yourself, dawg. Why would Joe get Butchie up? If Marlo can make him talk, he puts Joe inside your big score. If Joe turn Butchie, I tell you, shit, i help you even. But it just ain't like that. Come on, yo. Finish it. Brother way too kind-hearted, so I took him up under my wing. <laughs> you was just looking out for him, huh? I told him how I was gonna be. He needed to give up his bracelet and wear mines. And if he did that, I would be sure that nobody would punk him or cause him any bodily harm. That's what happened? You persuaded David to trade bracelets? Wasn't about to wear no murder bracelet. I could wear one with some bullshit charges on it. Shit, I thought I might get tip on out of here if they got to setting bells again. And you know where they sent him after Hunt? Last time I seen him, he was stepping on the bus to some other damn purge. I don't know which. Why would you do this? Why would you take my boy's name like that? Cause us all this misery. Respectfully, ma'am, I know how to jail. Your boy don't. Upgraded the office. Doc said diners are bad for my arteries. Why you just order a salad? Salad. The point is, is to go unnoticed. Who orders a salad in a diner? Come on, man. Get it. Salad. We all understand your decision to walk away. But in our line of work, you don't retire. You get retired. And retirement is always a bitch.
pictures yet? No, not yet. How deep that boy will pop? 180 in these pockets. Pretty many. I need them. Looking for them. 180. Shit, I seen the boy Titans up for the Kennedy. Yeah. Yeah, they was looking for uh, Dominican food. Yeah, that's the nigga name. They was looking for him. You know, they must be trying to get that dog food or something. Yeah. Only way ain't knock them two boys' heads off their shoulder. It's out of respect of Dimitri's uncle, Melvin. Yeah. So I ain't gonna have no choice. But you feel what I'm saying? What's the TV plans with you? Because obviously you were on The Wire for a long time. You're yep. an actor. Uh, what's coming up? Well, I got The Deuce right now. Uh, HBO just picked that up. I play a kid named Leon. James Franco is in it. It's about the, um, taking over the porn industry and uh, prostitution extortion in the uh, 70s. One hopple pop. Hope it's like home. That looks about right. Bitch, you late. You hear me? She got to play here. Did I say something, you motherfucker? Come on. Man! Yeah. I'm at 10th and 37th. The diner. I just shot a nigga. Come and get him. It's gonna be amazing. Wow. Um, I want guys to stay tuned because, like, I'm not playing. A, this is my first time not playing a gangster role. But I got another movie called Dermaphoria be out late summer. But this, I was so excited about getting this role that they're going to see me in a whole nother life. Just when you, and that's an interesting position because you're a big star in one world, right? Right. And in acting, you've had a nice success, but you're yeah. also hustling. Like, you just, it's, a, it's a craft that you learn later in and life. And you see the Malik Yobas in the auditions and you run into all these people and the, I'd be like, okay, dang, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm coming up because I'm, I'm reading Audit, same, Reading with the good people. And then I got that, we got, a, we got the number one web series, Transitions. Everyone sees what you Clean this shit up. Clean this piece of shit up. Fuck. Fuck. Tell me, real. I gotta see. Hey, I gotta see. Trans oh, you gotta look it up. I play Adonis. I'm the, the um the lead in it. Man, Juan Glover, sag actor. Them guys gonna regret that they didn't kill me. Believe that. Just be happy. <sighs> I'd be more happy if you got me my money back. Maybe voice was that tutorial, but what you were doing wasn't illegal. It was just a game. Come on, come on. Is this some type of fine I gotta pay? <laughs> Cause I think a gunshot covers me, really. It all happened so fast. One guy was there, and the other just appeared at that moment. <laughs> yeah, and I got shot in my arm. Hey, I need to call my wife. <laughs> Your wife? Man, forget your wife, Hollywood. I need to speak with my lawyer. Man, I'll be out of here by lunchtime. Man, I posted bail an hour ago. Y'all have no right to pull me back in here again. Come on, come on. You think I had something to do with all of this? She could only have gotten that raw track record with you. <sighs> come on, man. Look, Zoe was a groupie. I brought her home after the show like a few months ago. Classic. Look, she just.
jack that beat from my house. Then she tried to blackmail me. Look, I didn't pay her a dime. So I got a bullet shot in my head. <laughs> the whole Miami. They owe the money. Like, but, but not me. Come on, man. Look, if you guys don't mind, I have an appointment to get to. Good day, officers. Hardly. I always, I always stunk at sports. When I always thought the pros were just a bunch of overpaid babies. <laughs> hey, I heard that. Good. Everybody that tuned into uh, Transitions on Amazon Prime, man. You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's right from the city. We've been working hard on this project, man. And I want everybody to know it's not a game. You can see yourself on that screen. It's focus. You know what I'm saying? Just focus. We're putting hard work in. You hear your man right here, yours truly, Adonis Blackwell. Transitions, nonstop. Shout out to everybody in the city that's been tuning in. Amazon Prime, tell a friend, tell a neighbor, tell a coworker. Let's get it, baby. Amazon Prime, transitions, what's next?